Charles Thomas, winemaker with Quintessa. Great. Charles, you see this case? I do. I'm going to walk out of here with that case. Uh, it'll self-destruct in five minutes after you leave. Oh! Hi, dude. It's Brenda Bullington here with Ladero Vineyards. We're up on Howe Mountain, and what we're drinking today is the 2005 Howe Mountain Cabernet. We made 3,000 cases, and the Garrett Colors are rock star white maker. And I'm hoping that you like it. Now, would it bother you if I said as long as you had this wine that I loved you? Oh but 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 that when you no longer have this wine, I would just leave you. you know would that what? bother you? I would actually then sell her myself at least 20 cases on the side, so you would love me a lot longer. Wow. Winemaker from Orchard Winery, and here representing Dry Creek Valley today, and just talking a little bit about the diversity of soils that we have in Dry Creek. And as I was saying, you can see here that these soils are all found in Dry Creek Valley, and you see basically, you know, the dramatic difference of the different soil origin. It just really paints a dramatic picture of the incredible diversity of soil that we have in Dry Creek Valley. Does anybody ever call you the dirt guy or dirt? I, I, I've been called a hell of a lot worse. I'm with John Tyler Wines. This is um, the original Waytag from the 1973 Chateau Montalena vintage. My grandparents, Charles and Helen, were the uh, um, producers of 40% of Chardonnay grapes that went into the 73 vintage that won the 1976 Paris tasting in France. So this is the original document, and uh, we like to share it with everyone, bring it to tasting, tell them a little bit about it. Great. So, do, uh, do you ever sing... The Macarena, except instead of the word Macarena, you say Montalena, like, hey, Montalena. Oh my god, that's so clever. <laughs> Should I do it, it? It's clever, it's not, it's not stupid. No, that's really clever. Oh, okay, awesome, hey, thank you. Well, who's the producers of that song? You should, you should copyright it. Uh, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go give them a call right now.